Welcome back to The Market Chef. We've got Chef Ryan here in the County Supplies kitchen again today. We've got some other cool ingredients. We've got some Castel Franco salads. I know it's winter time coming up, but these are a winter special. Okay, Rob, amazing ingredient here, looks great. Tell me a little bit more about the process behind it. So they've been growing this, Castella Franco, the same today as what they did in the 18th century. Wow. Big plant, take it back, starve it of daylight, soak it in water, which gives it oh, wow. amazing sweetness, sure. gives it these delicate speckles, which really is what brings us to the, Feels as you can see, the, the speckles, the Castell, it's an amazing product. So we've got a real gem of winter salad here today, chef. So what gem are you going to cook us up today? There you go, mate. Over to you. Cheers, fella. So Rob, and for you guys, I've got an incredible, incredible Caesar salad that I'm going to do here. Like Caesar? <laughs> Love a Caesar salad. Bacon, croutons? Absolutely not. So we're going to do a twist on the classic. Bagna cauda, heard of that before? Never heard of it, chef. So it's anchovy, cooked garlic, beautiful kind of Caesar dressing style, a mouth of lemon pan grattata, a little bit of crunch on top. It's going to take this phenomenal product to superstardom. Ryan, I'm starving. Let's get cooking. Can't wait to taste it. Love a Caesar salad. Let's go. So here we have an incredible dish and, you know, incredible for one reason. Look at that for a start of the show. We've got the Castel Franco. Plays a little bit of a role of those amazing summer ingredients like gem, romaine, iceberg, all those fantastic lettuces. But as we step nearer to the winter, you know, you've got this beautiful, leafy, slightly bitter, slightly sweet ingredient. And I think we just carry it through with the great Caesar salad, you know, and pay testament to the season with this incredible product. And to partner that up, we have some amazing ingredients, some textures from some roasted pistachios. Uh, we've got some chives, had a little bit of savouriness, some Amalfi lemons, again, just cutting in with that acidity. Uh, we have the poached garlic that we're making a bagna cauda. Now, bagna cauda is basically an anchovy and garlic sauce, very, very simple to make and a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of salt. So let's get cracking and start doing the dish. So what we've done here in the pan, we've toasted some of the beautiful Castafranco. When I say toasted, you've got a lot of sugar in there. Look at that, just steaming. Beautiful, that bitter kind of sweet texture. We're gonna finish the dish with some of the raw Castel Franco as well, just for the aesthetics, variation in textures, as, as we say quite a lot. So this is gonna be our serving platter. This would go great with, you know, it'd go great with a roast. It would go great with some grilled meats, anti-pasto. It'd be absolutely phenomenal. A lot of people throw away the root as well. So holding it up like a little lollipop there. It's perfectly edible, no need to throw it away. Just want to stack it like that. So we've got that lovely kind of plate in there and just being really rustic. Get some of that core in the air. You know, as you can see, it's wilting from that steam coming out from the pan. So we want to get some delicious anchovies. Now brown anchovies, some people don't like them. I think they're incredible. You could use white anchovies as well. We just want to dance a few of these over the salad. What they add in? Salt, natural occurring umami. And again, what would, what would uh, a Caesar salad be if it didn't have anchovies on? So, as we've made the bagna cauda, beautiful process. We just want to, this is gonna take, you know, this salad to another level. So just, again, just drizzle over the leaves. It's poached garlic in milk, a little bit of olive oil and salt. Absolutely delicious. And then we want to add a little squeeze of lemon. Again, just playing against that salt and that bitterness. Acidity is very, very important. Some roasted pistachios, adding some texture. And for me, it's, like, it's got like an eeriness to it that I really, really like. You know, kind of vintage look to it. And then just to freshen the whole thing, got a little bit of the heart of the Castafranco. Kind of just dance a little bit of that around here as well. Adding some different color, not forgetting an incredible finish with some of the pan grattato, which is a crispy kind of sourdough crumb. That's got your little crouton moment going for all of those out there that were saying, he's got no croutons. There you go. And the garlic plays a nice role. No need for any cheese here with the Parmesan because you've got a nice richness from the garlic. And there you have it. So you've got a beautiful dish, roasted Castafranco, toasted pistachios, Bagna Cauda, Amalfi Lemon. You've got a Market Chef, County Supplies, another great dish for your autumnal table. Right, Rob, I'm ready for you. Come in the kitchen. I've got your Caesar salad, mate, like never before. Why don't you have a little tuck into that? Let me know what you're thinking. A bit different. Looks amazing. Looks amazing. Why don't you tuck in? You need a knife, don't you? Grab a chef's knife. You're in the kitchen after all. 
Oof, look at that. Wow. So you should be picking up some um, some really, really nice textures in there. You know, we've got the pan grattato, mm. the, like the croutons, you've got the roasted nuts, you've got the bagna cauda in there, the anchovies. You know, you've got the, the, the toasted lettuce, the raw lettuce in there. I say lettuce, wow. again, playing into the respect of a Caesar salad, but we flipped it on its head. It's the Castel Franco. And the sauce, talk us through the sauce, Ryan. So the sauce is bagna cauda. Now, bagna cauda is a classic Italian dressing. It's made from poached garlic. You just poach the garlic about 20 minutes in milk, drain it, milk again, mm. poach it for 20 minutes, take the rawness out of there. Really nice savouriness, that moorishness that you get with a Caesar salad. That's why it goes perfect in making this dish with that ama amazing ingredient, so special. Beautiful. So there we go, as you're tasting that, absolutely incredible salad, savory, delicious, crunchy, slightly sweet from that incredible product. Market Chef, County Supplies, absolutely smashed it again. Rob? Well done.